Now that's more like it! Only the barest wisps of sunlight have crept down to this, the deepest trench of the ocean depths. Woo! I just remembered! You're gonna be one of my favorite characters. I remember when I was your favorite. See how that turned out? Watch your back, Fate Maker, or you might find some things. Bad luck or bad choices. Dead all the same. doing down here, smooth skin? Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a little salt on the way she said smooth skin. I'm offended. I think. Honestly, I don't even see what the big deal is about having skin. Sometimes skin's too dry. Sometimes skin's too wet. Ugh. No thanks. Yeah, you wouldn't get it. It's a skin thing. Okay, the next person to say skin is spontaneously combusting! She said it first! I'm just walking through. What are you doing here? I am sorry. It has been a very long time since I spoke with anyone. Of course, you seek passage. I can aid you. Here, take this cipher. Now, gaze upon the shrine and let the words flow through you. Yeah, thrill. Yeah. How'd I do that? Only the coiled may be granted passage through the drowned abyss. This cipher grants you our speech. There are three more shrines. You must intone their words aloud before the doors to the Temple of Sacrifice will open. This was once a sacred place to me and my <laughs> Long ago when we shared skies, for the days of chains. Before the drowning. You must reach the Temple of Sacrifice. Inside is a light that will grant us passage. <coughs> Okay, she's creeping me out a little. And not just because she used the S word. Yeah, she's got too many proper nouns on her. Chains, drowning, sacrifice. Yeah. What? No! She's great! She's really yeah. gonna like her! You could have trusted the skeleton man just fine. Uh, yeah, he was a pirate. Okay, well, with your detect intent ability, you can tell that she's a real sweetheart, who's honest and trustworthy, and you love her. Yeah, but the priestess class has the concealed intent ability.
I've got vengeance on my mind. Fine, I can't resist lore. What's the deal with the drowning? This city was once a beacon of civilization. A symbol of the united, coiled people. But some crave power and allied themselves with the dread void god known as Thrill. When he was cast down to the death by other gods, so too was the city dragged with him. Sounds like a real bummer. I was there in the hour of splitting. When our elders passed their love with drill against my warning, since then I have stayed as the caretaker of this place, alone, with the maddened cries of the once sisters. It was the promise of bugs. Worms won't go over tonight. Even after the drowning, my sisters continue to practice profane rituals. I have observed their rites and know them well. We will need to light a fire. Why would there be a fire pit in an underwater temple? Well, uh, because it, uh, was a surprise ambush! Seeker of passage, you will need a magical emberjack, a fiery fish whose flames burn even underwater. Right, but all the fish died when we blew up the ocean. Uh, fine, then there's one in a chest right in front of you. That is one dead fish. Could it still light a fire? Wow, Valentine, I didn't know we had a fishologist in the house! It's a magic fire fish! And it's got tons of magic fire juice still all up in it, okay? Now, come 
complete the sacrifice! All right, newbie. Time to give up all your blood. The fish itself is the sacrifice. Oh! Huh. Okay. <laughs> the temple has accepted your sacrifice. Follow that light. It will take you to the final step of your passage. See? She didn't want to sacrifice you after all. She's cool. I don't know. Something about her just makes my... <laughs> I'm sorry, what was that? Skull! <laughs> it makes my... Go crow? Ooh, are you sure that's the, that's the word you wanted to use? Because there's another S word that you could use. I mean, there's still some time for a... Uh, nope. This is a completely normal phrase that everyone else uses. Makes my skull crawl. Normal. Mm-hmm. Yep. Suspicious. Look, ugh, please, you guys will really like her if you just talk to her a little more. I am afraid I haven't been completely honest with you. Aha! I knew it! There is one last sacrifice to make. Here it comes. And I make it gladly. I will go with you. What? When my sisters fell to the temptations of drill, I blamed myself. I vowed to remain in solitude for my sins. But you have shown me that passage through hardship can only be accomplished alongside friends. I will join your party and aid you on your quest. No, what? No! There has to be a twist. She's lying. The priestess's maddened sister's attack, drawn by her nefarious spells. Sisters, I defy you now! Seeker of passage, you have given me hope. I will repay you in kind, with friendship. Yeah, not buying it. No, dude, she really needs it! May I have a hug? It has been so long since I felt the warmth of another on my skin. Oh. 
She said the S word. No, 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 she didn't. She super did, and you said. I know what I said. Oh, fine. Spontaneous combustion. I never saw the sun again. There. Are you happy now? I. Uh. Here, let's all just go talk to the evil god of the deep, shall we? That sounds like fun. <clears throat> You did your best, Fate Maker, but you can't save everyone. Not with a bunker master like her. to kill her off. Yes, I did, because you made me. And now I have to throw out this whole story I had ready. And you know, she had a troubled past and a yearning for friendship and a whole redemption arc, and now it's gone. I don't know. I just thought you were setting up a cool fight. said the S word, she would still be alive. Oh, well, so now you care about rules. Well, here's a rule. Rule of threes, bitches! Didn't like 
Sora. And you probably don't like me. And, and you're gonna leave, and I'm gonna be all alone again. What? See, we're not leaving. We're having fun playing this game with you. Yeah, that boss fight was awesome. And newbies kicking Mega Turbo Butt as the Fate Maker. Well, you're gonna stay? Like you said, fate doesn't divide us. Fate brings us together. Of course we're staying. I want to see how this ends. And maybe Kasara could even come back as a friendly ghost. Nah, she's dead him over it. Quest complete! D do the thing where it says quest complete! You see how fragile she really is? All that fear, all that doubt. Where do you think she puts it? Right into this world. She has all of the cruelty of a god and none of the responsibility. 